Welcome back to Paradise, everyone. We are episode 47. Wow, we're getting up there. Um, today we got some big plans in store. We we temporarily moved Rain Shop out of the way. Uh, new crafting recipes. Um, what is this about? So we got a pop-up, new crafting recipes, and it looks like a bridge, but like a single lane one, like the old style. But we have all the wood type bridges already. So that's confusing. Anyway, as I was saying before I was so rudely interrupted by that random recipe, we got big plans for today. Um, we're going to try to get Rain's area figured out. Um, I was kind of thinking about where I wanted it, and Ooh, we have a visitor. Um... Nice to see you, Dad. Nice to see you too, Clover. I don't want to fill these areas here. I kind of want to keep them as, like, park areas. I might put, like, park benches and stuff. So that means range shop is going to move down to here. Now, i got to prepare this area, and I've got to move the visitor site, but I can't really move the visitor site with a visitor in it. So I can prepare her area and move her shop, and then uh, move the, the visitor area another, another time. All right, from Fletch. Uh, tin bar, tin bar, tin bar. You can never, ha never have enough tin bars. Perfect. The rest is money. Um, so that's gonna be like the goal for today, is to um get her shop moved kind of into the final location. So before anything happens, let's go. Let's go get our moving deed so that if it goes into the evening, we can still do it. First, we'll pay off our debt from last time. It's a rainy day, so we don't have to like water our crops, which is great. Um, let's talk about the town. Move a building. Uh, let's move the greenhouse, right? Yep. And shop D. Okay. Let's actually quickly just take a look at what they call the other buildings. That was some of them are. Interesting. Oh, shoot. Thanks, Fletch. Uh, you're five star. Honestly, um, let's see if you've got an easy task, but... Yeah, that's an easy task. Uh, she wants one of the Waddle Brew I have on me, and she'll pay 14,000 dink for it. Yep. That's like now half the relocation fee we just <laughs> paid. <laughs> We got a dancing uh, achievement over here. Oh, Forest Maker. Oh yeah, because we did a big replant at the end of last last episode. Cool. So since it's raining, I'm just going to quickly check on the farm and see if there's any crops to be harvested. I feel the loud music is very loud today. Um, just I apologize if it's not loud. There. Um, I find with the rain and stuff, it was very loud in my ears, so I apologize if it was loud in your ears as well. Um, anything to harvest? Ah, some pumpkins! Nice. Ooh, lots of pumpkins. I guess that makes sense, they were all planted about the same time. Cool, so that's done. Wheat is not ready. And cabbage is not ready. I'm going to leave this tomato by itself. It's always one that... Uh, ripens a day early. I must have, I don't know, missed all the rest of the watering one day except that one, or um, NPC watered it and I forgot. I don't know. But either way, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it for now. Um. Yeah, we got that last time. Uh, we got some stuff to sell. Okay, let's. Um, we've got Rain's deed. Uh, this shop looks like it's up to date well. Oh yeah, we gotta go see our animals. And then we'll sell these random things to John, and uh, we'll get started right away on, on rain stuff, because I don't want it to fall off the radar today. Okay, three chickens, eggs for three chickens. Hey, Sandra. Sorry, it's another wet day. Pet Kinsley. And in real life where I live, it's been an awful, like spring, early summer, whatever you want to call it. It's just been raining all the time. It's 
super annoying. Like now is like one of my favorite times of the year is like uh, spring and fall. Because I like the temperatures, I like how it gets warm during the day where I am, but then it cools off in the evenings. Um, but that's that's not the case this this year. It's been wet and cold. Some days it gets super hot, and other days it's like very cold the next day. So not not having a good time. But that's okay. Summer will eventually come. Oh, I forgot a croco here the other day. At least he's in the water. Sorry, buddy. I really didn't mean to. Or did I? Bum bum bum. Yeah, let's drop you off. Go see a man about selling some fish or whatever this is. No, it's like a prawn and an inland crab. Um, it's Thursday. I was just looking at the date while I dropped that off, hoping it wasn't Sunday. Oh yeah, let's see what um. See who this is. Sally? Have I met Sally? Hi there, I'm Sally. I'm a hairstylist. I'm kind of new at it, though. If you'd like a haircut, I could always use the practice. Uh, I kind of... kind of like my hair, though. But in order to get people to move in, you got to spend money, right? Um, Let's just see what she has for tasks first. I can definitely do two palm wood planks. Uh, sure, let's give a trim. What's this like? Oh, sit in the seat? Okay. Sit. Okay, what can I do with your do today? See, that's a proper joke. I, I'm i okay with you laughing at this, Sally. You need to give Fletch and John some comedy lessons. Oh my word, a haircut or color change is 5,000. Uh, I really like my style. It is accurate of my real life hair. Potentially, maybe. Who knows? You don't know if I'm lying or not. Maybe that is my hair. Maybe I got a full head of hair. I don't know. I'm a dad. Who knows? New hair color. Ooh, that was weird. It, like, lagged for a bit. Ooh, I spin in the chair. Oh, my. Oh, my. Oh, I could have, like, Rain's hair. I don't want Rain's hair, but I think it looks really good on her. Oh my, 5,000 for this? Ooh, red hair. And then we're back around. Okay. Very, that's very blue hair. These are like solid colors. Oh, gray hair. Oops. Yeah, definitely going with the gray hair for dad. Okay. Nice. Well, thanks. I'm just going to cover it up now. Oh, you can still see it. Stylish hair. Here's a milestone for getting haircuts. Okay, let's go get her palm wood. Anything on the board? Oh yeah, alpha bush devil. How many days? Two days. And it's far away, right? Whoops. Yeah. Okay. Um. Keep these rolling. Oh, I'm a little discombobulated today. Okay, let's get our palm wood planks. She wanted two, right? Two. Planks. Grab all the poo we can. We're hard up for poo. Two. Okay. Go deliver these. Really gotta fill in these holes now that we're starting to get developed. I wonder if an NPC's ever fallen in them, or if their pathing is better. Uh, no. Sure did. You're a bloody legend, Dad. Just for your trouble. Honey, alright. Sorry, I paid you 5,000 to color my hair, I'll take 34 back. Alright, let's uh, inventory clean up here a bit. Um, I don't think any of these are donation stuff, so let's just go to John's. I was thinking about buying a tape measure to help plan out my city. What is this? Whoa, it's like a box of miniature creatures from the island. John, what do you got going on here? Um, I see like diggos and bush devils and crocos. 
birds. I don't know what that looks like a piranha planet of Mario. See a, a moo in there. John, what is this? Prize box. Hold on. Prize box. What are these? I can get a cape? Cape. Who wears, who wears a cape? Prize tickets. How do you get prize tickets? Tape measure. What's this? Oh, it's a new sign. What is this? Read. It's the John's Goods anniversary event. Is that grammar right? John's Goods? Yeah, John's Goods. It's a... Never mind. John's Goods anniversary event. For every fish, every fish you sell to John's Goods, you will earn a prize ticket. Prize tickets can be exchanged from the prize box inside the store. This is a limited time event. So get fishing and start redeeming your prizes. Happy fishing. Uh, John, what is this? You got any more information? You're a totally different person from when we met, Dad. I mean, you've always been good at what you do, don't get me wrong. But I really feel you've grown a lot since you've helped me get set up here on Paradise. John, what's the prize box, dude? I do these count as fish? Not these, obviously. Find out. All up, I can offer you 4,893 dink. Very good, I'll take these and here's your money. Thank you for visiting. Okay, so... They didn't count? Um, this... This may have derailed our whole day, everyone. Um, it sounds like... This is a limited time event, and he didn't say how limited it is. So... Um, I'm inclined to go hard at this. Let's take a look at what the prizes could be. And I'm going to get my fishing rod ready. <laughs> this is going to level up our fishing a lot. Um, so it says you get one prize per fish. So let's, uh, let's take a top one. A dinkum shirt. What's a dinkum? Huh? So it takes three prize tickets. Okay, what about a hat? Also three, cape, three. Okay, are they all three? Nope. You can get a dress for one, but a cap for three. That seems weird. Ooh, a tuxedo. We can get the whole outfit. A seamstress dress? It's got powerful energy. <laughs> Ooh, a lab coat. Ooh, that's gonna be fun. One. Oh man, okay. Black hood, three. Plushies. Okay, uh, so you can get a croco plush. How much are these? Five, five, okay. Magpie plush, Moo plush, Bush Devil plush. Wow, Frilly plush. Wow, it's like all of them. Pincher plant plush. I haven't seen the pincher plant yet. But everything else is in the game, so I assume it is as well. Ooh, bouquet pot? For only one? Okay. What? Anniversary balloons. Come on, how much for the wheel? Yeah, eight. Ooh, fancy. Red carpet path. For five. Roll it out. Velvet rope fence. Oh man, that'd be like awesome in front of the museum. You know, like kind of like the Met Gala stuff. Like it's just really fancy. Fairy light wall. Statue. B bubble blower. The fun never pops. That's only one. Does it work? Like, can you actually blow bubbles? Frying pan. It's got an attack. It's a weapon. It's not. <laughs> Uh, when I first saw this, I thought maybe we could, like, cook anywhere kind of thing instead of at a cooking table. But no, it looks like it's just a weapon. A frying pan, not just for frying. Okay. Was that 25? Oh, man. Okay, so that's the most expensive item here by a long shot. So, let's... Oh, does cooked fish... I've cooked fish on me. Does that count? Uh, no, I still don't have any. Okay. Let's go catch a fish. Wow, this 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 derailed our day. I'm no longer confident we can <laughs> we can get any of the work on Rain's new place done. Um Let's find out. I guess John closes at like six, right? So we can we can still do something. Oh, that's a terrible cast. Still do some of that.
Come on. Seriously? Three fish now? Did they... Did they change that sound? It sounded different to me, but I could just be imagining it. it sounded like the, the real in sound was different. Oh, double bite. But only one fish. I wish you could catch two fish, that'd be fun. Yeah, like this clicking sound sounded different to me. Anyway, again, I'm probably imagining it. Anniversary event. So, in my research before I played this game, I th think this game released into early access like last summer. So it would make sense that this is kind of the coming up on the one year anniversary of, of Dinkum. I mean, I didn't get into it until the last, you know, two months probably. Oh no, no. Have I caught this fish before? This fish seems really strong. I was blabbing about getting into the game and I lost that fish, broke my reel. I may not have. I may not be able to... S oh, I got the little one this time. No, I was so close. Patience. I want that big guy over there. He's now like my nemesis. Oh, I missed him. Oh, big guy. Here we go. Here we go, you're mine. I got him. I'm gonna let him fight. I'm gonna pull him in. Oh man, he comes so slow. No, oh, my goodness, he just wrecked my reel again. I think I've got. Mm. I think I don't have a good enough fishing rod. No. This probably isn't worth the time sink. Yes, I got him. A what is that? Baramundi? Baramundi? There's no way I've caught that before, right? Yeah, I have not. So you get donated. Above all, it's... It's donations over prizes. No. Alright, let's just turn these in. See what this looks like here. So I assume I can't cook them because he didn't he didn't give me tickets for the cooked fish I just sold him. Yeah, he's got the uh, the fish book over here that was like a hundred and twenty thousand. Um, sure, I'd love to. Oh, I gotta see a man about some prizes, I guess. Okay. Hey Rain, did you hear there's a like a fishing competition going on basically? Play dangerous. Alright, John, how do we do this? Do I just sell them to you? Let's sell one and see what happens. Let's see. I'll up I can offer you 2,000, sure. Here, I'll take these. Oh, and I believe I owe you one prize ticket. You'll get one prize ticket for each fish you sell me. Don't forget to check the green box, blah, blah. Sweet. Alright, well, John, I got a few more for you here. Yep. Don't care about the price at this point. So what do we want to buy first? I kind of want to see if this bubble blower works. Let's do it. I can exchange more, right? Because I've got... I can't. Oh, yeah. Hey, can I get any plushes? Oh, yeah. Here we go. Get out of this sailor outfit here. Oh, that's sweet. Okay. Okay. Real test. Does this bubble blower work? <gasps> no way! You can't move when you do it, which is sort of disappointing, but 
Look at our town. Oh, they keep floating. Look at them. And I, I should start doing screenshots for my episode because that would be the screenshot right there. All right. That's awesome. And now we have to catch a whole lot more fish. Sorry, it's just now the rules. So this episode could be a little boring for the next little bit. He closed. John closes at six o'clock. We gotta go, 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 go. I'm not even gonna blab. You only have to put up with me fishing poorly for one hour in game. Oh no, only 45 minutes in game. Fish, fish, where are you? How long is this event? Will it be going tomorrow too? Come on. Oh, this is way too slow. Great one. Let's go. Keep going. Keep going. Only Thursday, so he is open tomorrow. There was another one here fighting for it, right? Oh, he moved. Yeah, I gotta catch this one that head back. It's not a lot of tickets. It's only three more, but I could get one more thing. Can't mess us up. No, can't mess us up. Okay, go, go. That should allow me to buy one of the uh, five ticket things. Be great if they, if they, if the game had him stay up later when he's doing an event like this. Sucks that it's time box through him. No, I'm not gonna have time to get the prizes. Six o'clock. As long as he's in the shop, right? No, he's moving. No, move. Okay. What can I get? Um, I don't know. Anniversary balloons? Sure. It doesn't say how many tickets you have. That's that's a miss. I have no idea how many tickets I have now. I, I mean, they're in your inventory, but I I don't know what they have. All right, well, that's disappointing that it's gated by, like, not open on Sundays, and it's it closes at 6. However, this, this is a problem for my productivity in the game. <laughs> nice. Amazing. They look so good. Oh, meat up there. And the bubbles are still going oh, on a nice clear day. That'd be great. Okay, so. Um, okay, that was a surprise. We need to get to work. Um, so Rain's area needs to be uh, transformed. Where I'm going to put her area, I should say. No problem. Uh, her shop is... One, two, three, four, five wide. And how much of a gap did we leave on the other ones? Like two? One, two... I want to stagger them, but I made them the same. One, two. Let's make her gap only one. So one, and then one, two, three, four... I never did buy that tape measure that I just said. I wanted to buy to make this kind of stuff easier. <laughs> I was so distracted, John. I stopped spending money at your shop because of you. So let's just fill this in.
I think I like that I took the stairs off the the outside edges going up to Town Hall, but now it needs something there. Um, I think it needs like some some planter boxes or something. I think I've got some recipes for those, so I will work on that as well. You know, make the place look nice. Okay. Um. One, two, three, four, five, and then we'll go back to this corner. Yeah, we'll be in good shape. Okay. Need my sand block. Try again. Hey, Sally. Welcome to the island. <laughs> you like what I'm doing here? I really want Franklin to move in. Can't believe he hasn't already. Oh, no, 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 Sally. Get out of the way. That's why I missed. It's Sally's fault, right? I really want Franklin to move in. I've sold him a ton of dis dish discs. Wow, that was really hard to say. I'm sorry. A ton of discs. I've had him commission a quarry for me. Maybe I need to have more stuff commissioned. Um, I think his hearts are enough. And yet he doesn't want to move in yet. Makes me sad. Oh, well. He will eventually, right? And we'll get some cool machines from him. Launch me into the air. All right. Let's clean up this little bit. Already getting tired. Great sand project is starting to near its conclusion, I think. We've got a lot of our NPCs moved in, our villagers moved in. Just need a couple more, but being stubborn. Oops, get back in the water. I gotta decide what to do with our... Oh, that's a big battle over there. You didn't stand a chance, Jackaroo. You had four diggos on you. Um, Gotta figure out what to do with our landmark identifier here. The letter P. Whether I move it and keep it, or whether I just destroy it. Uh, also, at the end of this season, I'm going to move the crop farm in behind Reigns, which is going to be here now. Um, and in turn, my house is going to move up to where that farm stuff is. That's that's the idea. Okay, let's um, put you away for now, get the deed out. Sally, do you mind? Uh, yeah, that'll work well. All right. Rain is moved. We need more palm wood steps. That's what that is, right? Because, I mean, when it opens tomorrow, we need her to be able to walk up. I'll walk up the stairs. That, that would be bad. All right. Yeah, what... what? <sighs> yeah, I've had four bridges of each kind for a long time now. So I don't... I don't really know. Um, either way. Either here nor there. Uh, Palmwood Steps. Uh, Palmwood Steps, and I just had an idea about, um, hey Fletch, about, um, a lamppost or two. Speaking is hard. And we need, like, quartz, right? Quartz and nails we've got lots of, and we need uh, some more torches. Wee. 
Um, lamppost. I think four. Oh wait, we wanted to do... Yeah, okay, we did the ones around Fletch. Good. Stairs. Cool. And animal products. Right, inventory is is killing me here. Cool. Uh, I'm gonna try to bury that mushroom too, because it says to bury it. Let's see what happens. So let's see what happens. Great. Um, excuse me, Sally. I know you're new here, but oh, hers is five wide, and I just made. Four four steps. Oh, no, I mean... What? How many did I make? <laughs> oh, well. Doesn't matter. Can I kind of hang this over the... Oh, the bulletin board's already got its own light under there. I don't want to do that. That's too close to that other light. Let's... Uh, I did two spaces, so that's... Kind of annoying. I did stagger these ones. I did two spaces, but I staggered them. Oh, well. I probably put range shop in the wrong place. Oh, well. Doesn't matter, right? Cool. Um, one more lamp post. Maybe over my work area? Jump. Yeah, that, that works good. Cool. Um, well, this was a super different day than I <laughs> expected. Oh, I want to bury this thing, too. Uh, where should I put it? Oh, it like, glows in my hands. That's cool. What does it look like? I don't even know what it looks like. Um, <laughs> let's put it by the, the coconut tree. It's like my misfit area. Oh, I gotta actually bury it. Okay. Uh, a seed? Ooh, like a seed. Ooh, that's cool. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll take it. I dig it. Okay, let's... Uh, We need money still. So let's... um, Let's grab a couple Krakos here. Ah! Who turned out the lights? Don't worry, Theodore. I'm just keeping the town safe. Alright, I'll probably catch these and then call it a night. Don't want a toad skin. Really? No crocos? Alright, well, this is, uh. Oh, poop. <laughs> uh, this is poop. Yeah, that's a good line. Um, this isn't really super exciting to watch, so I'm probably gonna stop the episode here, but I. Wow, what happened here? So many questions. But thank you for the meat. And people are having indigestion problems. There's like poop everywhere. Um, anyway, I'm going to stop the episode here because I, I don't need you to be subjected to my awful uh, commentary while I hunt for some Krakos. Just looking to make a few more bucks before I turn in for the night. Anyway, uh, thanks for watching. This was a... Uh, I mean, it wasn't a different episode. We accomplished our goal. Rain shop has been moved and we lightly prepared our area. Um, however, the big news of the day was John's fishing competition. That's pretty exciting. 
So hopefully it's still here tomorrow so we can get the rest of the stuff or a lot of the stuff. It seems like we're going to need a lot. There's a lot of, you know, five ticket, eight ticket, three ticket kind of things, which will add up quickly. So um, that's the goal for tomorrow. We'll keep working away at that. Uh, so thanks for watching. Day 47 here on Paradise. We'll see you on day 48.